Sylvester Stallone caught our eye at courtside at a Miami Heat game, but my eye went to that $250,000 Rolex watch. The question is, which Heat player will be crowned today's champ on Fashion Face Off? Slide some oil on my boy Tyler Hero, out here looking like the Tin Man in this Alexander Wang tracksuit. Now, I do love how he stands out when he's walking down that tunnel, right? But also feels like he just threw this on. In other words, this outfit is wearing him, he's not wearing the outfit. What it's missing is a little flair or some might say, a heart. Aww. Jimmy Butler proven that if you can't make an outfit interesting with the shape, make it interesting with color. Cause I am loving this color coordination, Jimmy. The brown hat, the brown pants, even down to the brown and that portable speaker. But for me, it's all about that Ramoa Tiffany oh. luggage. That is a $12,000 bag, y'all. And listen, when you're making 45 million a year, you gotta spend it somewhere. Bam Adebayo out here looking like Miami's Ken. Hey. More importantly, I think every man needs a good crossbody bag, and Bam is matching his to his Louis Vuitton luggage. Now that is luxury, people. Also bonus points, my friend, for those clean white Air Force ones without the crease. I see you. Unlike mine. Yeah! Okay, now Caleb Martin is a man after my own heart, okay? Cause he's mixing a little bit of high and low fashion brands. We got these $1,800 sunglasses, the Fendi sneakers, but those camo pants, those are $80, you guys, $80, okay? Now, I would have maybe loved to remove just one layer. You know, it feels like there's a lot going on, which is a friendly reminder to y'all, before you walk out that door, just take one item and leave it at home. My fashion fave of the week, it comes between two of the lads with luxury bags, Bam and Jimmy. I think the edge has gotta go to Jimmy. I can't stop thinking about that Ramoa luggage, the little Tiffany blue wheels, I die.